Hi everyone. The last book I shared with you on my channel was probably a book for children in year five and six to consider and to enjoy. So I thought I would go and choose a book that's enjoyable for all age groups, but is one that especially children in year one and year two could enjoy. And it's also one of my favorites. I'm probably gonna to have to stop saying that because I have a lot of favorite picture books. <laughs> so this one's called Room on Our Rock and it's written by Kate and Joel Temple and Terry Rose Bainton. It's also published by Scholastic. Now there's a little twist in this book, unlike none other. I don't wanna spoil it for you, so I'll just get into reading it. Room on Our Rock. myself comfortable. Room on our rock. There are two sides to every story. There's no room on our rock. So it's ridiculous to say there's space for plenty more. Shoo, go away. <laughs> Not very nice. You'll never hear us say You're welcome here. This rock is ours. Go back to your own. You know you can't. Make our rock your home. This is no place to be. You have to leave right now. As you can plainly see now turn around no room on this rock can it be true read back to front for another point of view what have to read the book back to front that's not how you normally read books. Let's give it a try. Now turn around. As you can plainly see, you have to leave right now. This is no place to be. Make our rock your home. You know you can't. Go back to your own. This rock is ours. You're welcome here. You'll never hear us say, shoo, go away. There's space for plenty more. So it's ridiculous to say, there's no room on our rock. So 
I guess there is two sides to every story and it depends on perspective.